Hello everyone, my name is Joanna and this is Teen Book Tuesday. Since it is unpleasantly warm today, I have for you a book about the unpleasant cold and a number of other unpleasant things. This is To Stay Alive by Skyla Brown. To Stay Alive is a novel in verse, which I love, and also historical fiction. It tells the story of Marianne Graves, who was 19 at the time her family joined the Donner Party to travel west to California. And if you've heard of the Donner Party before, that particular piece of American history should bring to mind one word, and that word is cannibalism. And you know, starvation, extreme cold, survivalism, doing whatever it takes to survive, and a healthy fear of shortcuts. The Donner Party was a group of pioneers who traveled west in the 1800s in covered wagons. Unfortunately, they are running late in arriving to California and de decide to take an untested shortcut that was recommended to them at one of the forts they passed. Long story short, the shortcut takes them several weeks longer than the main trail would have taken them, and the families are snowed in due to like 20 feet of snowfall in the Sierra, Sierra Nevada mountains. In To Stay Alive, we see the story unfold from the perspective of Mary Ann Graves, who is traveling with her parents and eight siblings. You might think that a novel in verse and poetry is a weird medium to tell the story of death and cannibalism, um, but because the poetry makes you focus so much more on Marianne's thoughts and feelings about the events, I think it actually works better than just a prose novel. The cannibalism in the story, and that made the story such a fascinating part of history for so many people, um, is actually handled with um, more from the perspective of thoughts and feelings and deciding to do whatever you need to do to survive rather than focusing on like the gory details of actually eating another human being. Make no mistake, it's a heart-wrenching story, but I thought it was handled particularly well. I would recommend this one to you if you like novels in verse, historical fiction, survival stories, and if you've heard of the Donner Party but don't know much about what actually happened to them. That's all for this week. I hope you're all staying cool and you're enjoying the last few days of summer. Bye!